Hey everyone, in this video I'm going to answer which one of these beaten down innovative growth stocks is the better buy today. Nano Dimension, the 3D printing company, or Inventay Court, the genetics testing company, both highly innovative companies. Also, they've been beaten down. Each of these stock prices is down more than 90%. So let's get right into it, comparing these two on revenue. And looking at revenue growth, Nano Dimension ahead of Invente at 43.48% compared to negative 5.12% for Invente Corporation. Looking at the next metric, I wanted to compare these two on operating profit margin. Being as though they are innovative growth stocks, I expect them to be losing money on the bottom line. And they are losing a lot of money on the bottom line. Invite Corp in the trailing 12 months, negative 122% operating profit margin. Meanwhile, Nano Dimension with a negative 268% operating profit margin. I will say for Nano Dimension, they have been doing a good job of reducing these losses as they have grown revenue. These losses are shrinking on the bottom line, although they are still significant. The next thing I wanted to compare these two on is cash flow from operations and a similar story here. They're both negative with Invitate and smaller negative at negative 74% compared to Nano Dimension at negative 204%. But again, Nano Dimension doing a better job of reducing these losses on cash flow from operations to sales. Finally, I wanted to look at valuation and Nano Dimension is way more expensive on a for, on a price to sales ratio. Nano Dimension stock is trading at a price to sales of 17.26, while Invite is at a price to sales of 0.605. So, if I had to pick one of these two innovative beaten down growth stocks today, which I want to highlight, I would not pick either of these. I would not buy either of these stocks today. These are not the types of stock I invest in. Companies that are losing so much money and have yet to prove they can be sustainable in terms of revenue, cash flow, and profitability. That's not my area of investment. And if you've been following my channel, you will have gotten that theme that I focus on. Companies that are a little bit for, more further along in their growth, in their revenue, in their profitability. But I did get questions about these two innovative growth stocks, so that's why I'm doing this video. And I do research these stocks, and I do research a lot of innovative growth stocks that are losing money on the bottom line. I just don't invest in them, and I don't necessarily recommend them either. However, if I had to pick between these two innovative growth stocks, I would pick Nano Dimension, even though it's significantly more expensive. What I like from Nano Dimension is its progress in using its revenue growth, right? It's growing revenue much faster than Invite, but that revenue growth is helping to bring losses down. It's demonstrating economies of scale. Revenue is growing, losses are shrinking, it's moving closer to profitability. I at least see evidence in that, and I see more evidence from Nano Dimension of economies in scale than I do from Invite. So if I had to pick one of these two, I would pick Nano Dimension. All right, but that's all I've got for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I want to thank The Motley Fool for sponsoring this video. Visit fool.com slash parkev for the 10 best stocks to buy now.